Hey everyone, welcome back to Geeky Fun, and we are back with Sally Face. Um, so right now we're just going around trying to find some paranormal activity. So let's -a go. Do do do. Um, we found batteries. We got some stuff done, but. We were, something about a red ball. I'm not sure what that was all about, but apparently we're supposed to find something about a red ball. Oh, we're not gonna tell him about this. All, all right, that's cool. Is there anything creepy in your room? Hmm. 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 Nope. It's not. I'm checking out every room. I trust no one. And he's still waiting on candy. That's a little disturbing. That's actually some dedication right there. Alright, let's go floor by floor. Floor one. Let's see. Do we I don't think since the chapter one we've been able to go outside. Nope. I don't think anyone lives in there. All right. How may I help you? Oh, good day. Um, anything in Graham Graham's house? Oh. Oh! 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 What did I do? Oh! Oh my, what is that horrific device you have? It's a, uh, well, it's sort of hard to explain. You really shouldn't tamper with things that you don't understand. Lady! Graham Graham, what are you? Ew. Alright, game time! Alright. Chapter 1. She desperately sought a place among the council. So the aspiring witch traveled deep into the castle for the initiation trial to retrieve the Book of Forgotten Truths. Oh! Right? Uh... Is this like the last one? Sorta, of, kinda, maybe. Uh, ah! Crap! Yep, yeah, back, back, back to the demon circle. We got this. Wait, this kind of looks like the lady that was... Oh, was this the lady in the church? I don't know. Uh... Man, I was doing so good, too. Do, 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 do. I don't even know how this goes. Alright. I don't want to die. Oh, how many of these do I have to do again? This one took forever! Bleh. Alright. Woo! Face to the wall! Face to the wall! Alright. Dude, this is like really long. Holy crap! Oh, and if you touch these, you have to start- oh. Oh. You gotta be really cautious, because I really don't want to start this over. Oof. Who has this many spikes just randomly laying around, by the way? I have questions. With no answers, as usual. Alright. Oh, that's really close. Oh. Oh, this is really close. Ah! Oh, I don't like it! No! Uh No! Huh. Oh. I would have been so mad if that's where I ended. Oh! Woo! Take the book. I have retrieved the book of forgotten truths. Will you not see my worth now? The council recognizes the great resolve you've shown us today. Let this book stand as testament of your place among our ranks from henceforth. May our sight pierce the heavens and our reach be infinite and everlasting. For we are the devourers of God. 
Alrighty then. Graham, Graham, what are you doing in your spare? Oh. Did I get kicked out of her house? Graham, Graham? Graham, Graham. Mm, I don't trust you now, Graham, Graham. Nope. I don't care. Nope. Nope. Miss Gibson would kill me if I bothered her again. Dun, dun, dun. All right. Where to next? Todd's place. Todd, what's with the weird shit going on? Can you explain? I check out your bathroom again. Nope. No more poop vortexes. Much obliged. Ew, I don't want to bother them either. Alright, Todd. Todd. Todd a Todd. It's strange, but I can't find any reports of past murders. The only one that comes up is our friend Charlie, but look at this photo of him on the public record. Wow. What the? It gets even weirder. There's no trace of any of the officers that were here that day Mrs. Sanderson's killed. Not even the classified police records. It's as if they weren't here at all, or like they didn't even exist. How is that possible? I'm not sure, but I'm gonna keep looking into things. Check back in a little while. Okay, I'm gonna keep searching for more supernatural stuff in the meantime. Perfect. Hi, Bob! I like you. You're my friend. I don't care what your family insists, I like Bob. Rude. So very, very rude. Alright. Oh! Can I knock? Knock, knock. Housekeeping? Housekeeping? House housekeeping? House house housekeeping? Nope. Alright. Well, fuck you too. What if there's like a torture chamber in there? There's too many possibilities. You lived here and moved after what happened to- Aw, oh, do I get a to tone to Charlie's place with this? Hmm. I don't wanna do this. Ah! Shit! Ah! Um, what? Yeah, I I'm, I'm kinda asking the same thing, dude. What the hell? I'm not getting an idea of what any of these symbols are, and it displeases me greatly. And I still can't go in the bathroom, so that's a nope. Alright. So I think I've checked almost all the second floor. Will Megan ever show up? I thought we were friends, Megan. Megan, come on. No one's home. Chug is downstairs. David's place. Sup, brother? You still ain't found your pants, dude. Pretty busy right now. Alright, guess there's nothing going on on the third floor. Back to the fourth floor. I think I've checked almost everything. Checking my place again. Hi, kitty! Kitty cameo face. Bathroom. There's nothing in my poop filled bathroom. Dad, look what I got. Look what I got, Dad. 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 Dad, a brew. Dad, I got something cool. Why don't you pay attention to me? Daddy! Hey, Dad. Nah. Forget you too, Dad. I'm gonna rebel. That, I don't even know. <laughs> you know, I feel like being this, being like their apartment, like there might be more things going on here, but apparently not. Just the weird cat watching TV. Alright. 
I want to go in there. Don't let me. I want to go in there. Oh. Go on this here. And I just realized I haven't been looking for a red ball like a dunce. <sighs> Floor five it is. All right. Five of four. Homeless newspapers. Can't go in any of these rooms. Maggot! Maggot! Thought we were friends. I've been creeping everybody's bathroom for our friendship. Why don't you love me, Mika? Uh... I don't see a red ball. I just see a bloody bird cage. Well, maybe now that I got another symbol, I should go talk to Todd. Oh, okay. Oh! Okay, all I'm getting are symbols. That didn't look good. You're right, that did not look good. Todd. Weird symbols are popping up everywhere, and I think I'm gonna die. Oh, I got it right this time. Todd. Todd. It's strange, but I can't find any parts of the They only come up for a friend. That don't look like Charlie. But, okay, you're not gonna help me with any of the- What- What do the signs mean? I have questions. Wait. You know what? I haven't looked at this in a while. Puzzle box that belonged to Larry's dad. It's missing a piece, so I can't get it open right now. Is there anything new on the gear boy? Uh... Nope. So it only works when there's like people involved, not um So what, do I just have to keep like is there like a specific order and I just have to keep going to these bathrooms? That's odd, but eh. Is there anything new down in the basement? I'm gonna check out the place again. Uh, doesn't leave anything to use right now. Should probably keep an eye out for, uh... Probably keep an eye out for the pants. No, or the red ball, my bad, not pants. Um... So I guess I'm just gonna hold this thing up wherever I go. And I don't see anything here. Um... Oh, yeah, I knew there should be something for the kitchen. It's another symbol. What am I supposed to do with these symbols? What the? Oh, that unlocked one. Sweet. Well, I should probably go check in with Todd again, see if he's found anything. Oh, so I just needed one more. Okay. Um, I want to play the game real quick. Well, I'll play the game in Todd's room real quick. Or in front of Todd's door. No, I'm where I need to be. I knew there would have been something in Larry's place. Had to. Alright. Now let's see. Uh. Number six, was it? I don't know if you guys noticed, but like, sometimes the like, gear boy comes down in the bottom, or like in the top left corner, and it gives you a number. And I'm realizing that's the number that unlocks it. Chapter six. A young occultist found herself tangled in the bowels of the castle searching for the final components the council required. Ah oh, man. This is gonna be multiple ways. This is gonna take a while. Do 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 Alright. I might if if I get like a dead end, I might just kill myself to restart. What is the last component that you require? Since I have no idea what I'm looking for. 
Alright, there's a lot of multiple ways to go. How long is this gonna take? Maybe I shouldn't have played this game yet. Alright. I like the little cloak and the little hood as is cute. I like it. It's that like creepy cute. Um, I really don't know where I'm going. Uh, oh! Is this what I need? Oh! Okay. Wait, how many components were there? Crap! Uh, I feel like I need an adult. Hopefully, if it's like the other game. Oh, so, the, oh, oh! I gotta find five items. <sighs> Four more to go. This is an inconvenience. All right. So each point of the pentagram. Okay, this one's a little. Bad. Oh. Oh my. There might be two items over here. Uh, nope. It's very annoying. Dead ends. Or split ways. Aw, oh, really? Dude, suck it so hard right now. You asshole. You fucking asshole. There better be something this way or I'm gonna be really pissed. Alright, 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 alright. We got this. We got this. Ah! Really? Okay. I'm gonna go up here so I can see both sides. Alright. Uh, this is stressful! And I've only found one item! Only one! Not two. Oh. Alright, I got the second one. I gotta find three more? Holy crap, dude. Not cool, brah. Not cool. Fuck it. Yay, they kept my skulls. Oh, okay, so I guess it's not for each point. I don't. I'm so confused. Oh wait, there was one down where it split this way and I went up, not down. So, let's see what happens. Let's see if I can get a little bit better and pick up the pace. I don't know how that didn't kill me, but all right. I'm gonna take it at face value. In question not what we have seen here today. Okay, I really hope there's only three instead of five. Which, knowing my luck, it's gonna be five. All right. Oh yeah! Oh yeah! Woo! Okay. Well, I only found three, but okay. I have retrieved the remaining assets. Very good. The preparations are now complete. Stay within the circle while we perform the summoning. I understand. Oh shit! What have you done to me? <laughs> what did they do to me? Okay. Alrighty then. No, thank you. No, thank you. Todd, I saw some weird shit. Uh, Todd? Todd, my boy. 
What, what we got? I found something interesting. It's a missing persons case from 1987. Megan Holmes, age 7, lived in Addison Apartments with her parents, Luke and Stacy. Looks like it may be your little friend from upstairs. She must be the daughter that Greg, from my bathroom, was telling us about. The stories line up, right? Well, here's where it gets weird again. There's an update to the report one day after the original was filed, stating that the girl was found dead in Wendigo Lake, that's a few miles south of here, along with her parents. It says they had been fishing and fell into the river and drowned, some kind of mudslide or something. That's definitely her. Wait a second. I've seen that necklace before. I know I have. She's never wearing it when I talk to her, but I've seen it somewhere else. And you haven't been able to summon her, even with the super gear. Oh, yeah. Perhaps finding that necklace will help somehow. It actually makes a lot of sense. It's something she had a connection to when she was alive. And I just remember where the hell I saw that thing. Okay, I hate to be that person. I gotta check out Larry's mom and see if that. Okay, that came out bad. I gotta see if Larry's mom has it. Cause I think, I think she does. Maybe. Could be wrong. But let's go on a magical adventure into the pit of hell, it seems. Ah, uh, that look back at it. Doesn't seem very magical. Oh yeah, what was I looking for? Oh, it's a picture. A photo of Megan from before she died. Her necklace may be of some significance. Alright. Larry's room. Let's see. Nope, but I was going after Larry's mom. So, okay, the way I'm saying this is all just sounding so bad. Lisa. Hi, Lisa. Can I get you anything? Alright. Where have I seen it? I know I've seen it. Um... You know what? Maybe it was Graham Graham. I don't remember. I'll just go through each one again. This is the best bet when you forget what you're doing. Graham Graham? Graham Graham? Are you okay? Is anything okay? I haven't been in a long time. I meant, yes, I know, Sally. I'm not going to drop dead on you. Not today, at least. Thanks, Graham Graham! Crazy old bat. Let's see. Nope. Mrs. Gibson, kill me. I don't really care. I want to go in Mrs. Gibson's house. Just saying. But, hmm. Everyone seems to love your tea. You should open up a little shop in the town or something. I bet you do really well. What a fine young chap you are, Sal. You know, I don't often talk about this, but it was once my dream to do just the thing. Though once my father passed, I decided to carry out his dream of maintaining the Addison Apartments. Don't you think your dad would have wanted you to follow your own aspirations? Yes, I suppose he would have. Though it's much too late for that now. I couldn't possibly abandon this place. You could always sell it to someone who would take good care of it and then use the money to start your business. Well, come take a gander at our own little entrepreneur in the house. You're a true inspiration, young sir. However, I'm quite happy with my life here. I get to keep my fa keep father's dream going and also make my tea for the tenants. Sort of the best of both worlds. Oh yeah, I suppose so. Hey Terrence, no one has called me that by a long time. Ha, <laughs> I had almost forgotten my own name for a moment. I just want you to know that I understand what it's like to be afraid to hide away from the world. And if you ever want to talk, I'm here for you. Thank you, Sal. You're a good person. A true friend. Aww. Easter Addison. All right. Let's see. Does that mean I'm not supposed to use my spooky spooky for a while? Where is that cross at? I don't know. I just don't know. Um. Floor number two, please. And we'll start from the top. No, we'll start. No, yeah, yeah. No, I'm already on. I'm already on one. We'll go with two. Todd's place. 
What the f are they doing in there? Bunch of weirdos. People lived here. Charlie's old place. It wasn't in here, was it? That'd be kind of odd. No. Wait. Does my dad have it? No. Does my... Wait. Hold on. Is he the one who has it? Chuck's place. No one's home. Um... David's place. Sup, brother? No. Dude, you still need to get your pants. College. What are the college students doing? I, I want to know. I think they're right above that one that keeps making sacrificial noises. Sal's place. Dad. Dad. Alright, well, it's not dad. You know, I really don't appreciate the lack of attention and love you give me. It's very disheartening. Just thought I'd let you know. Dude, where is this cross at? I feel like it's in plain sight and I'm just not getting it. Hi, Gizmo. Alright. I've checked almost every room. What am I not- is it in the treehouse? Do I keep missing this and keep forgetting the freaking treehouse? Well, we'll check five and then we'll go to the stupid thing. Locked as usual. Uh, nope. I want to know what's behind that door too. Why is it boarded up? Hmm. I should keep this on again. I haven't left this on for a bit. Let's see. And I don't think it's in the birdcage room. So, let's go to the treehouse. Boop. Uh, what's the vending machine guy coming so Chug can stop being weird? Oh, not anytime soon, I suppose. A golden cross. Have you seen this necklace? Hmm. I don't think so, though it does look a little familiar. That's what I thought too, I'm pretty sure I've seen it somewhere in the building before. Belong to Megan. I'm gonna try and find it and use it to summon her. Alright, I'll come with you once you find it. Sounds like a plan. Hasta la vista, Sally. Alright, so it is in this building. I just gotta find it. Well everyone, I'm gonna stop the video here today. Thanks so much for watching. This game is getting a little more creepy and a little more paranormal, and I'm starting to like it a little bit more each and every time. Well, thank you guys so much for watching. Feel free to leave a thumbs up or a comment down below. Feel free to hit subscribe. All your support is appreciated. And as always, guys, stay awesome, stay geeky. Bye-bye.